What's up guys, it's your boy Ivan here today, I'm back with another video, um, we're doing another GTA series, um, basically we just did the Lamar down, and yeah, we're now going to be doing um, the Meltdown, if you haven't seen the Lamar down in the last episode, we basically just, um, we saved Lamar from doing the most stupid thing ever, and I just crashed, um, my man, legit, um, yeah, how do I explain this, he legit went with the ballers after all that's happened, and his dumb, dumb ass just went, you know what, I'm gonna, third time's the charm, I'm just gonna go see the ballers again, <sighs> honestly man, he did the most stupidest thing ever, and also I apologise if the recording was so long last episode, Let's just say I had my mates over and they legit wasted so much time. So much time. Like, I'm talking, they spent legit a whole hour, pl like, on this mission. Sure but yeah, time to get in the limo. Honestly, ah. Do Americans just like limos? Like, in the UK, we only have limos if we're going to prom. But yeah. There's the car. But yeah. Oh my god. Why did we go with Jimmy? Out of everyone, why Jimmy? Calm down, Nate. Oh, you are working, you lazy ass. That's basically James Corden. To be fair, a lot of movies are getting shittier. It's just an opportunity thing. Woo! Yeah! You see the Strizz Edge losers? Jizzle in the movie bizzle! Here to find Why does Jimmy keep thinking he's in the movie business? Hear it, and I don't like it. Mate, you're just a kid whose father is a movie producer. You're not a movie producer, calm down. And not to, like, gawk at celebrities from behind a barrier. We're actually, like, properly invited! B to the I to the P. I would have Jimmy, shot Jimmy if I had to listen to that kid. E -N -T, uh, title Maybe I'll shoot I myself. Oh, pop, chill. Bro, Jimmy, shut up. Let's take a drink. Jimmy, oh, shut Devin's up calling. Hey, Devin, look. I need to say about Molly, man. I'm sorry, but I didn't do it. I told you to slow it down, slick. Slow it, it down, was an slick. Accident. I was there, but I had nothing to do with it. Sure, yeah, hey. You made a fool out of me, Michael, and that is something I'm not gonna forget. Look, Devin, I said oh. I'm sorry. I feel bad for you, but you don't threaten me, because this movie's happening, all right? So let's just calm down and try to be friends again. Yeah, isn't he like... Absolutely slick, forgive and forget. Namaste. I was gonna say, isn't he like a yoga instructor? Like, my man, just chill. Yeah, you don't get to have sex with Holly ever again. But hey. I think that's why Michael... Um, I think that's why Devin wanted Michael to die, but... It's funny because he was the one that gave Michael the opportunities. Like, he legit got him into this. And now he's like, fuck you, bitch. I guess it's true what they say keep your friends close, keep your enemies closer. Oh, I hate this guy. We did it! Solomon. We fucking did it! Fucking A! <laughs> Fuck you, fate! I may be a lecherous old has-been, but I'm a has-been with a premiere at the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. I'll see you in there, kid. Hey, thanks. Enjoy the- The hell was that? Mr. Richards, 
Mr. Richards, hi. If I could just bother you for a second. Um, I'm Laszlo from uh, Famer Shame, um, but I do some acting on the side. I was wondering if. Uh... Oh yeah, of course. You should come see me, kid. I think I got a project. That would be perfect. <laughs> That's me. I would be up like that. It's called the closet. Oh, this called him a pedophile. Pervert. Oh, it's this guy. Sorry to bother you. Quick question. Get in here tight. Um, love, love, loved the movie. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. When, when you were that polar bear and you had to eat your baby. I what? All right, Jesus Christ. That was emotional. Stick and I just have a hug. That really affected me. I guess that's a light heart. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on. Come on. Let's get in there. Ah, Laszlo. Oh shit! Come on. We never actually got to get it. Wait, can we get in there? Where the hell is she? Looks like she stood you up. Hey, hope I'm not too late. Oh no, no. What are you doing here? Jimmy's like, fucking, don't touch me. Meltdown. Congratulations, Mikey. We did it. No, don't you say we? Oh wait, I guess. I guess Devin did kind of help. You see, I was here. Unlike your wife, seems to be stuck at home. How does he know? Oh, he's done something. Let's go, Jim. Come on. Oh, Devin, you fucking prick! Don't tell me. We gotta get to the house. You have two minutes to sacrifice. This prick, this actual dickhead. This rich asshole is pissed off at me because I didn't shit can the movie. And then his lawyer died, and, and he just told me he's gonna hurt your mom. You killed his lawyer? And now he's gonna kill mom and Tracy? He ain't gonna do anything if I gotta say in it. But you fucking killed his lawyer? Oh, for fuck's sake, I was doing so lawyer? well. No, I didn't. It was an accident. I would never do anything to put you in danger. Shit. Alright, okay. They'll be fine. They're tough. This is just a movie guy, right? He, he's not a gangster or anything. No, he's not a gangster. He's just extremely rich. Oh, for God's so sake. All these connections. All right, Jimmy. Oh, for God's sake, no. Oh, for... F oh, I, how did I miss? For God's sake. Okay, good. Fair play to Amanda for managing to hold that guy. Oh no. Come on. Oh, thank god. I thought I almost killed Tracy as well. Okay. Just stay here. Keep your heads down. Yeah. Baby. Ooh. Damn, Michael's gonna get in tonight. I think this is the first time that we've had a GTA mission in the house, in a house, like in one of the characters' houses. You know what I mean? Like we're actually fighting, like Meriwether in the house. Great, my wife's gonna have to buy that. Get down. How much Meriwether did Devin Buck get? For one person. I think I think what happened was Devin initially had the first Meriwether truck to go after the family. And they knew that since Michael was going after them, they just brought more in. Cause why are these guys showing up later than the first ones? It just doesn't make sense. Also, I can't shoot this guy because of the bush. But yeah. Get out of my garden, yeah, get out of my garden. Now my gardener has to do all this crap. Wait, I just realized they're going to have to get a cleaner to clean all this. What's the cleaner going to think? What, they killed them? Oh, don't, oh, don't mind. Oh, what the, what the, what? Imagine what you have to say to the cleaner. Oh, don't mind them. They're just like, they're just blood because you know my wife's been having a period. Of, oh my god! Dick. Uh, right. <laughs> no, it's not. What was that? 
Oh. Someone there? Oh, it's Jimmy. I'm gonna start shooting. Where do you get these goggles? Oh god. <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you, huh? Oh, oh no. Great. Get the fuck off me. Uh, I, I thought I was on that guy. So you sit on his face? It's I don't know whether really Yeah, good old cod moment. Right, listen, I'm gonna make a call. It's all gonna be okay. Where did you get the military stuff? Also another thing, I don't know whether to put Jimmy saves the family or Michael saves the family. I think I'll put Michael saves the family because, um, because, well, Jimmy, Jimmy technically saved, I don't know, because, because if, if you think about it, if Jimmy, Jimmy saved Michael, but Michael saved Amanda and Tracy, because if you think about it, if Michael didn't shoot Amanda, is like, if she, how do I say if Michael didn't shoot the others, then Amanda and Tracy would have died. Man just hit a pole with his knuckle. Shit. Why is he at the pier? I ain't looking for perspective, Lester. They came after my family. Alright, right. I don't know what to say. Does this change where you stand on the Union Oh yeah, I forgot about that. We move on that right away. Oh. Before it gets any hotter. I think the next mission will be the the big score. Yep, there it is, the Union Depository. So yeah, that's going to be the end, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Sorry, this is a short episode. I just I didn't want to spend like thirty minutes me waffling. So yeah. Um. So yeah, let me check what what the score was. Oh, just the time and aim. But yeah. That's going to be the end, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, and next time, peace out. And oh, and when you see me the next episode, I'll be doing the big score. See you later. Bye.